Life is determined on your outlook of it. No matter if it's sunny outside, if someone does not see it to be a great day or it's going to be a great day, they cannot see it. But you can have the opposite effect. It could be raining outside. It could be storming. You know, it could be, you know, hell, you know, whatever it may be. And someone can say, you know what? It's a great day. It's going to be a great day. It's all about your mindset. It's all about how you envision that day to be. It's all about how you look on life. If you don't have any money right now, instead of uttering the words that I'm poor, say, hey, you know, hey, my pockets right now may say otherwise, but in spirit and in mind, I'm, I'm rich. The physical just has not caught up with it yet. See, we have to understand that we have to be mindful of the words and the things that we say, the way we use certain actions and certain practices and things that we do. Because our outlook is so, so important that even the way that you view your own self is very, very, very important. If you view yourself to be nothing less than, then that's how you're going to operate. That's how you're going to move. But if you see yourself as being someone as a business owner, a king, you know, someone who can conquer pretty much anything that they set their mind and their being to, then you will accomplish great and mighty things things. I don't let anyone tell me what I can accomplish. I don't let anyone tell me what I can and cannot do. We all have obstacles and things that we're going through in life, but we should not let that stop us. I don't let anything stop me. You tell me I can't do something. I'm not even going to tell you I'm going to going to do it. I'm just going to look up and next thing you know, you're going to say, whoa, he actually, and I'm just going to be like, yeah, I told you, but I didn't have to physically tell you because my outlook is different. The way I see certain things, you may not see it, but I know where I'm headed. And it's only meant for me to see because the vision has been given to me. I try not to look at life even when things aren't going quote unquote my way. It's just one of those things where it's just like, cool, let it be. Because I know in the end, when it's all said and done, things will go my way because I'm clean hearted and I'm remaining pure and staying focused to my craft. You got to stop being so negative. The world has taught us to be very, 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 very negative whenever we see certain things. From everything that's surrounding us, it's just negativity. You need to find your quiet place and be able to meditate and get it all off of you and then be able to bounce back and show people I can still operate in the world. Things are not going to go your way most of the times. The plans that you make are not going to go according to plan most of the times. You have to show your resilience. You have to bounce back. You have to continue to work on you. And that means you have to change the way that you look at life or your outlook at life has to change. Stop looking at what you don't have and remember what you do have. I'm not talking money. Remember what you do have. Remember you're, you're able to use your five senses. You are able to use your, you know, everything, man. Your limbs, every single thing, man. Be grateful. Be thankful. Remember, your outlook determines, you know, life. Your outlook determines life. Remember that your outlook determines life. So stay right on track with everything that you're doing and everything will continue to go in your way. Once again, my name is Energy Eli. Please do make sure you comment, like, share, and subscribe. Believe.